fourth part, not even grades you want your kids to bring home. C plus for preventing nuclear terrorism, a B minus for preventing chemical terrorism, and a C minus for preventing biological terrorism. Our son Wisdom Martin explains why we are so vulnerable. Seven years after the terrorist attack of 9-11, opinions on just how safe the country has become vary. We were well, we've been fortunate enough that nothing's happened in our home soil, so I would guess that would lead me to believe that something has been done to make it a little bit safer. I think that what, what the foreign policy is, is that we've actually gone backwards since 9-11. Nuclear terrorism, uh, the fact that they can uh, probably get high EV into the country, uh, we need to secure our borders a little bit more. The Partnership for a Secure America group of Democrats and Republicans who used to be on the 9-11 Commission did a series of reports on how far we have come in the area of safety. The conclusion, the country is dangerously vulnerable to another terrorist attack. I think the United States is always going to be vulnerable to some degree. Matthew Rojansky is executive director of the partnership. The report touches on the chemical threat. We have chemical facilities in the United States. The next president is going to have to, to look and see that those facilities are vulnerable to something as simple as a truck being driven through fences and blown up and uh, sending uh, toxic materials around the It addresses the biological threats, too. We're in a place right now where there are more states uh, with nuclear technology or the potential to create a nuclear device based on the technology that they already have. Rojansky says regardless of who becomes the next president, the key to security will be getting everybody on the same page. We're simply not coordinating our responses both across the federal government and with our allies in the world. Now, the Partnership for a Secure America is holding a press conference tomorrow morning where former members of the 9-11 Commission from both parties will discuss this report. All right, Wisdom, thank you. Montgomery County's Police Chief means on adopting for your health.